Sent alert in Cobb County. Police say a 15 year old who gunned down a 16 year old Saturday is on the run. News Edge reporter Denise Dillon joins us live tonight from Cobb County. And Denise, the young man who was killed was a student at South Cobb High. Yes, and there were a lot of counselors and faculty on hand here to help the students when they went back to school today. A lot of students crying and just holding each other closely as they grieved. One young man told me while a lot of tears were shed, there were also a lot of questions like how this could have happened. Hey, they shooting outside. One of the kids got shot. Shots were fired outside Julius Edwards' apartment. He went running outside and saw a young boy bleeding. So one of the new neighbors that just moved in there, she's trying to keep pressure on one wound. I'm trying to look for the hole, and I'm trying to keep him awake. Police say Namar Kelly had been shot multiple times. He was rushed to the hospital, but didn't make it. He was 16 years old. This is not a game. You know, that's somebody that lost their life for nothing. Police say Kelly was at the Cromo apartment complex in Austell Saturday afternoon when another teenager showed up ready to fight. Witnesses on scene stated that the suspect in this incident arrived at the location uh, for a physical altercation with the victim. During that physical altercation, the suspect produced a firearm um, shooting the victim. Police are now looking for a 15 year old in this shooting. They have not released his name, but Fox 5 has obtained a letter from the principal at nearby Pebble Brook High School telling faculty members the accused shooter could be a former student at Pebble Brook. Kelly went to South Cobb High School, where friends say everyone felt his loss. They was crying. His best friend was crying. Yeah, but most of the people was crying. They had put us in the room. We was talking. We were just hugging each other and crying and talking about it. Antonio Bussey says Kelly was one of his closest friends. And the counselor was trying to cheer us up. And it worked a little bit, but it still helped the fact that he's not here today.